Hello and welcome back to the Evil Within 2. We came inside just to make ourselves some ammo and look at a slide. Now we're headed back and we're gonna... Gonna hit the next... Next area. God, some about this room is just great. It's more than just a white hallway, it's... The design of it itself is... I don't know. Can't put my finger on it. I mean, it's... It's not... It's aesthetically pleasing, but it's also... Like, deeply unsettling at the same time. It's not like... My reaction is like... Not like I want to live there or make my house look like that. It's... Just... Why are you waking up now? Oh, it's above me. All right, bit of a problem with the spatial audio there, but fair enough. Honestly, it shouldn't have kicked in until I was all the way up the stairs. Having it kick in here, I mean, it sounds like it's down there to me. I don't have any of those fancy surround sound headphones, but that's not really necessary. Because the human ear is an insanely impressive uh, piece of evolution. Um, and it, the ability to discern direction and distance based purely on binaural audio is, I mean, just incredible. I'm a big old nerd, so what do I know? She's facing... Oh, Jesus. Of course you're going to jump down. From fucking where, dude? Where the fuck were you hiding before? They're both going ham on it. Maybe now's the time to try out the silenced pistol. Or I could try... You know what? Here's what we're gonna do. Um... I've never used one of these. Well, that didn't last as long as I thought. Ow. Alright, now I understand the reasoning for extending the duration on those smoke bombs. It is handy, though. I didn't know they were just going to immediately, basically immediately stagger like that. That's neat. Um, sort of wish it had forced you to fire one. Like, each time you get a new bolt, they force you to fire it once. I know that could end up a little bit contrived, but I feel like in the name of encouraging players to, you know, explore all avenues available to them, um, that would have been a good choice. Uh, 
Got my eyes on all of you. And this spooky lab I don't want to go into. Um, that was weird because it was propped this direction. What do and we have here? That's not a two way hinge. Well, it could be a two way. Uh, no, it doesn't look like a two way hinge to me. It doesn't look like a hinge at all, actually, because that it's got the same geometry on both sides of it. Well, no, it's a little different. Those are hinges. So the hinges are not actually even, like, mounted to the frame. I know I'm, like, nitpicking the door frame in a video game, but, like, you, d you took, a you went to all the effort to model this. Why did you model it wrong? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'm an asshole. Yeah, I don't like this. Not one bit. No thank you. Nope. Fuck that noise. I'm not pressing that button. Computer file. Operative case. Our worst fears have been realized. The loss phenomenon has spread to Mobius operatives. We had theorized that the transformations were a result of memory overwrite, but no operatives have been overwritten. We were able to quarantine and terminate an affected Mobius operative before he could transform. Perhaps his exposure to so many lost corpses in the pit made him susceptible to whatever is causing this. Perhaps it's merely a coincidence. We are harvesting his Unity cerebral chip in the hopes that it will provide new data. Of course, here's my, here's my in. Removal of intact cerebral chips is possible with the extraction device. It is a relatively simple and automated process. Merely place the subject on the gurney and enter the extraction device's activation code, 0128. If they haven't removed this guy's chip yet, I can use it to get through that door and find Hoffman. Oh good, I, I can't wait to see this. Ugh. Oh no. Oh no! It doesn't take arrow input or numpad input or top row number input. You have to. Oh my god. So this is WASD, and then what's the enter? Is it's, it's E. Ah. Oh. Listen, I, I, I know this was a console game as well, but. Number pads that you can't use number pads on are one of my pet peeves in game design. Okay, let's see what happens. No, I don't want to see what happens. I'm going to look away. You guys can enjoy this. Gross. I have to hear it, though. Well, that's surprisingly ungruesome. Um, something tells me if I entered the wrong code, it would like just drill a bunch of holes in his head. Just to gross me out. Wow, that is a large chip. Like, like real large. What the fuck is that? That's gotta be like at least an inch and a half long based on the size of the, the, uh, the legs on it. Unity Cerebral Chip. This, this electronic chip was implanted in the brain of a Mobius operative. For that matter, why is it even this type of chip? Why does it have legs on it? If they're not attaching to anything, why Why would you not make it some like sci-fi thing? Like this doesn't make any sense. It's not connecting to anything. Well, I guess maybe it's connecting to their brain, but then why, why would you have... <laughs> these pins out like this why would it not like be the, be the kind of thing where they have to if, if it has to connect to their brain you'd think they'd have to like wire it up to certain parts of their brain or something oh, thank god he's already dead 
I gotta get out of this lab. Is that the prompt for him to get up? Since I can't aim at him? Yep. Great. Can all fuck off. Why can't I pull out my... Why am I not raising my weapon? What is going on? Raise your gun, Sebastian. Thank you. There we go. Are these guys going to get up or is it just somebody around the corner? Wow, they just knocked the door down, huh? Oh, good. There's a smoker down there. That's what I want. Maybe I can clean up everything up here and then kill the smoker early with the sniper rifle shot. Or two. Is there anyone even up here? Did I see somebody in there? I did. What is it? Medical pouch. You know what? That's fine. I've never been down more than one at a time, I think, but... I, I wish I had more pistol ammo, more pistol capacity, but you know what? That's... I'll take anything. Whatever they want to give. I know. 20% of Union's populace has succumbed already. At this rate, there will be no one left in two weeks. Our efforts have been in vain. The Corps escaped less than a day ago. Within hours, we began to receive reports of lost emerging in staggering numbers. They're everywhere now. 20% of Union's populace has succumbed already. And they're actively hunting down and killing whoever is left. It's a nightmare. At this rate, there will be no one left in two weeks. We've lost contact with Mobius. We're trapped in here. With the lost. It's too late to stop now. The entire Union experiment is doomed. We're all doomed. I'm sorry. Your eyes are still glowing. Um. Well, yeah, that's unfortunate. I mean... The fact that all it takes is for the core to walk off. Like, I get that in the fiction they were hunting for, you know, the perfect brain for this for a long time. And the process of getting to that point was so arduous this isn't really possible. But, as with any technical system, you always build in redundancy. Like, especially if you're holding hundreds of thousands or millions of, you know minds in the balance I mean in my day to day I do a lot more uh, my the systems I work with have a lot more resiliency for things that are a lot less important is basically what I'm trying to say uh oh is she gonna find her way up the stairs? Holy shit, she is. Because I can't use the... the things as corners. Those don't count as corners. 
Are they coming up as well, or is... I think they're too busy chowing down on their pile of bodies. It's a bad spot. I'm in the middle, middle of a thing. Oh, wow. She didn't scream again. Andy. Did that do her? Yeah. Neat. I w thought I was going to have to run around a little more and bait her into another stab, but... Uh, I'm getting some some frame drop again. What is the effect that's doing it? I wish I could figure that out. I think it's the gas. I think the particle light and the particle effects and the light and shadow effects are really the issue. And it's not even like all the light and shadow effects. It might be like specular light on the like this stuff is all this kind the the haze here. That's all sprite based, but I think her like her gas and the flames and stuff like that are probably probably not. This is hmm. Don't really have another way around. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry about that. I thought he was going to turn around and run by now, but... Please don't see me. Alright, where are you guys going? Yeah, I know I could just light this place up, but I kind of enjoy the challenge. There's at least one guy over there. So actually, I'm gonna backtrack this way. So I think I'm pretty sure I can hear him. Ah. I'm like crooking my head over to one side like it'll help me see better. Alright. Almost got this mopped up, I think. I'm shocked at how many there are. I think these last ones I'm going to have to, well, oh. 
You know what? Um, is there another one? There was. Come on. Just get a little peek. Yep, there you go. Come on down here. See, for some reason, this cart I can get on the side of. Come on, dude. You can make it. Ah, oh, well. You make me do it the hard way. Good enough. Good enough for government work. So this other one jibbed entirely. Uh, do I not get a reward because they jibbed? Or maybe they just didn't drop anything? There's somebody else? This hole wasn't here before. More of you guys spawn in here? No. I kind of sworn I heard one more guy. So now I'm just going to run around like a madman and probably get killed. You know. Just to uh, show me who's boss. I could have sworn I was still hearing grunts after that last kill. But there's always just the ambient music as well, which may have elements I'm mistaking for breathing. Scanning for Unity Cerebral Chip. Please wait. Unity Cerebral Chip detected. Entry authorized. About time. Hope I can still catch up with Hoffman and O'Neill. That, um... Is that a boss fountain there, bud? I hope not. I'm going to cut the episode here. We're going to find out what we've got behind this door next time. See you guys then.